September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month, and this week a local teenager undergoing cancer treatment is being recognized for helping other children in his shoes. KXAN's Aaron Cargill is live in Cedar Park with this story under the Friday night lights. Good evening, Robert. We are here at Gupton Stadium where Cedar Park right now is beating Georgetown's Eastview High. The score was 28 to 14, but Eastview just scored. They're about to uh, go for the extra point behind me. But I got to say, the best highlight of this game came seconds before kickoff. It's the fourth game of the season. Cedar Park hoping to go all the way to state for the second year in a row. Get some! One of their biggest fans showing up early. All right. Any good. With a friend who is rooting for the other team. Wyatt does go to Eastview, and we are playing Eastview tonight. And, you know, I don't want to say we'll beat them, but... We probably will. But off the field, Lance White and Wyatt Perez are on the same side, fighting for their life. I have two brain tumors, uh, germinomas, and they're really rare. And to have two of them is actually even more rare. Acute lymphoblastic leukemia. And it's tough getting that through your head once you hear it. On this night, they are getting to experience something else together, an up-close look at the coin toss to help educate fans about childhood cancer. Side by side, they will continue to be one of each other's biggest cheerleaders. We've been there for each other, understanding what we've been going through. I'm blessed that he's alive right now and he's doing well and he's getting better. And the score now here at this game, Cedar Park versus Georgetown's Eastview High. Cedar Park leading 28 to 20. Eastview is about to either go for a field goal or a two-point conversion, not too sure. But I do have to tell you that Lance and Wyatt have prime seating tonight. They are watching all of this from the press box in the AC. And from this point forward, we're going to be cheering those two on. Robert, we're live in Cedar Park tonight. Aaron Cargill, KXAN News. Great story, Aaron. Well, Lance White was actually diagnosed with cancer two years ago this month. He was the first person in Central Texas to tell the Make-A-Wish Foundation he didn't want something special for himself, but he just wanted to bring comfort and joy to other children with cancer. After a year-long approval process, Make-A-Wish gave Lance a $5,000 grant to start a foundation called Lift Brigade. The primary goal is to provide video game carts to patients during chemo treatments to help them take their mind off the process. You'll find information on how you can help with this story at KXAN.com.